And Chris and Tom, can you talk about working on that relationship between Thorne and uh, Yeah, I mean, we, we had we a... Hate a, each other, a right? <laughs> oh, <there> we go. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, sometimes you get lucky and, you, you know, you, you work with people who you, you get along with and that just makes it an easier process and easier to find, you know, uh, little sort of hooks into the relationship. And, uh, uh, you know, both know what it's like to have siblings and have that rivalry and, and had, you know, uh, uh, so much fun sort of playing around with it. Yeah, I think it's kind of, um, I'd add to that, in, the, in that um, um, warring, competing brothers are, are just intrinsically, uh, inherently, dramatically interesting. It doesn't mean if it's, you know, Cain and Abel back in the Bible, or it's Edmund and Edgar in King Lear, or, um, or, or any, any story really, where essentially you've got two um, opposing forces who are competing uh, for the same thing. And in this case, um, it's their the love and affection and pride of their father. And what's great about the two characters is that they both, they're both enormously gifted. Thor is, is, is powerful and noble and strong and, and physically athletic and, and um, the leader of the pack. And, and Loki is, is fiercely intelligent and he's a strategist and is a master of magic. So the two of them together are a force to be reckoned with, but going up, up against each other is a whole other thing. And, and um, I should also add that, as an actor, it's it's um, it's much much easier to be really nasty to someone that you really like, <laughs> um, and um, so and and that was um, I mean it's, you you can't really ask for that you can't buy that and Ken must have seen something that he maybe with the two of us would get on or something but when when we first met, um, actually the I remember the three of us came over and, and uh, Natalie Portman was also there and while Ken was talking to Natalie we were dispatched by Ken to go and train together um, and Chris had me <laughs> lifting tree trunks and logs and uh, Tom taught me yoga and yeah <laughs> <laughs> that's, a, that's a good combination yeah we're doing yoga and I said no, Natalie Portman's gonna be here in a second I can't be seen doing this <laughs> let's go break something <laughs> yeah <laughs> let's go and throw ourselves through a tree um, and then Natalie Bowman came in and she was so flexible by that stage, she was halfway through her training for Black Swan that she would just drape a leg over the <laughs> edge of a sofa and be incredibly uh, physically impressive rather uh, shaming us all. Excellent. Uh, let's take some questions.